on thousands of presentations of the company. I've designed the presentations, uh, you know, that brought in the first 10,000 reps. So, you know, it, it, it's not a question of, of whether I know how to do it or not, but if I'm recruiting for myself, I'm going to use somebody else. Now, my, you know, in my case, I can only go, you know, to one person above me, which is Johnny, and then from there, uh, you know, to the founder. But, you know, that's what I use. And that's typically, you know, I remember uh, about 18 months ago, we were signing up people that were Black Diamonds and above from all different types of companies. And so, you know, I could have given the presentation. I could have given the presentation, you know, to all of those people. However, I didn't. I went upline all the time, went upline, 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 so that those people could get the information from somebody else. Why? Because when they, when you edify properly, all of the attention is going to be on that person and there's going to be respect for that person's expertise and business experience and it works don't ask me how it works i don't know i'm not a psychologist i'm not a therapist i just know that this form of communication works now if you don't believe me here's an example i just said that between the new ir and the prospect there's going to be trust in a relationship well let's take a look at the relationship of man uh, you know, or husband and wife. That relationship should be the most trusting relationship that exists. Now, in most cases, that's true. In some cases, it's not. But there's a trust in that relationship. But because there's trust in that relationship, people don't listen to each other. I don't listen to my wife. And, and, and I wish that she could understand this after 12 years of being together, that it's my job not to listen to her. Even though she's the most intelligent woman that I've ever met, she's far more intelligent than I will ever be, but I will not listen to her. In fact, I'll give you an example. Uh, 2006, we bought a, a, a brand new Lincoln Navigator. Uh, about a, a week later, we were scheduled to go to San Diego, pick up some friends uh, that lived uh, you know, about 20 minutes from us. Uh, when we woke up in the morning to go pick up those friends, we're running late, and as I walked into the door of, of, the, of the navigator, I saw that somebody egged us, and there was egg smeared down through the window, through the door, and, and it was kind of caked up and dried, and, and my wife says, um, Danny, you have, to, you have to take care of that, you have to clean that up, otherwise it's going to eat through the paint like battery acid. Well, I just told you that she's the most intelligent woman I've ever met, however, it's my job not to listen to her. And so I said, hey, we're running late. Let's go. And so we got in the car, drove 20 minutes to pick up my friend who's an engineer. Now he comes outside, looks at the same thing, and says, hey, Danny, you got to clean that up. Otherwise, it's going to eat your paint like battery acid. Now, word for word, he repeated exactly what I had heard 20 minutes before coming from my wife, who I already told you was the most intelligent person I've ever met. And here's a complete stranger. Well, not a complete stranger. He's my friend. But... I, you know, my trust is with my wife, right? That's my relationship. And I know she's smart, but because I trust her, I will hear her. But because I trust her, I won't listen to her. It has to be somebody else. And so my here's my friend who's an engineer, has nothing to do with, with, with cars, but he comes out and tells me the exact same thing. And I listen to that person. So it's not about what you know. It's about how this works. And so even though I know how to give a presentation, I've given thousands of them, if I'm going to prospect somebody and I want to have that person sign up, I'm going to go up line. I may even go down line and just get somebody else other than myself and edify that person properly. See, that's why you have to understand edification and why it works. And we do a whole training on that, and we'll have that next week. But you need to understand why edification is so important. Okay. So we kind of got off on a, on a very specific tangent there, but I hope that I, got, you know, I brought that point home. You need to get somebody else involved in your business if you want to see results. Now here's a checklist for serious business builders. Step uh, one, start your business by purchasing the Accelerate Pro Pro Progression Activation Pack. Uh, here's, here's something that you could use. You know, when some, you know, some people are looking at the basic, the advanced, or the accelerated pro, uh, program, you know, I always like to tell people, hey, these programs are all great. You can make a ton of money with each and every one of them. It just kind of depends on what your budget is. But let me tell you, the basic package is a great start. But if you're serious about building a huge organization, then you're going to want to do the 499. And then you just put it on them. 
So you tell them, hey, the, the basic, the advanced package, that's a good start. But if you're serious about building a, a, a huge organization, then do the 499 pack. And most people are going to do the 499 pack anyway once they start looking at all the different features and benefits. They start looking at all the different things in that package. And you know, and what it comes with, they're going to understand there's a lot more value to that $499 pack. Okay, next step two: monthly ownership at a minimum of 1,100 points for maximum commissions and commitment. Now, folks, it's never been easier than now to have a thousand to eleven hundred point out of ship. And if you look at our grounding and earthing products, if you just put one of those sleep systems on auto ship every month, right, you're going to get rid of it, you're going to sell it. Folks, we can't even stock our earthing products. I had an order of 22 wristbands, okay? And for those of you that understand the grounding products, you, you know what I'm talking about. 22 of them, folks, and 10 of them are out of stock. Okay, so we can't even keep it in stock right now. It's flying off. It's just selling like hotcakes. So we have, um, you know, with a sleep system, if you put one of those on auto ship, they range from 800 points to, you know, almost 900 points uh, that we have on auto ship just with one sleep system. Then you have your, your website, that's 200 points. If you have Extreme Media Works, that's another 100 points. So right there, you're already at 1,000, 1,100 point auto ship. So it's never been easier to be able to have an, an 1,100 point auto ship than we do now. We have to invite at least three to five new people every day to watch the company's webinar. Folks, I can't stress this enough. It's great that you're on the webinar, but it's even better when there's new people on the webinar looking at the product, looking at the services, looking at the opportunity. That's how we build. That's okay. It's wonderful that we're training each other every day. That's that's tremendous. But we have to go and talk to new people. We have to go and impact other lives. See, that's why we're doing this business. It's not just about money. It's not just about our health. It's we want to impact other people's lives in tremendous positive ways. And we can't do that if we're a secret agent. We can't do that if we're not telling anybody. We can't do that if all we're telling is the people that are in our downline. We cannot build our business that way. We have to invite new people, and that's kind of you know, that's kind of hard, especially if I already talked to all of my warm market. If I already talked to all of those people, then here's the thing, folks. And this is not going to be one of the eleven steps to success, but this I believe one hundred percent. Now you may disagree with me, but this is how I built my business, so I can only speak on what's worked for me. You need to have an advertising budget. You absolutely need to talk to people that are interested in talking to you. Folks, there's people, there's about 40,000 people joining a home-based business each and every week. Why is it that you're struggling to find somebody new? There's people out there that are looking for an opportunity right now. And you guys happen to have the best opportunity out there, period. Hands down, compensation, unique products, uh, marketing tools, all of that together in an industry that's already over four hundred billion dollars a year so you have a tremendous opportunity so why struggle talking to the same people that you've already talked to spend some money hundred two hundred bucks a month do it for six months we could tell you where to advertise we could show you where to advertise where we've done it and that way you can find people that are actively and aggressively looking for an opportunity right now okay so let's go to number four here, 